morning. Welcome to Trucks and Tech. My name is Double A, and today on set, we are going to tell you about Kenya's number one quarry king. And this is a tipper that is synonymous to anyone who works in the quarry. Now, we have shot about the 2516 tipper, which we have codenamed Mamba or Sepetuka. That link is somewhere up here, which you will see. But today, our focus is on this amazing tipper that is known as the quarry king. When you go to Eton, when you go to Kapsoa, when you go to places where quarry is the main economic activity, there is a preference for this beast over here. Now, not to confuse you, this is the third lorry in the Tata lineup that has the 2518 name to it. We have the Tata LPT 2518 Transit Vehicle, which we have already shot a video exclusive, and the video is up here. You can see the link up here. And today, our main focus is on this guy, which we also have another tipper with the 2518 name, LPK 2518, but non boogie suspension. Of course, boogie and non boogie, we all know these details. Focus here to Leo is on the 2518. And so, stick around on Trucks and Tech. Please make sure you like and subscribe and also share our videos so that we're able to tell you more. So, about the 2518, what makes this tipper very unique? This is the part where I invite you to work with me. And we are going to start at the back, right here. It's a six by four tipper. It's a six by four tipper. If you would just zero in with me, there's an animal that I want you to see. And that is why this guy is called the boogie suspension. It's a system of leaf springs that have been joined together with a joint and this gives this vehicle maximum comfort despite the terrain that you go to. The other tippers have something different. They have what we call a tandem joint, which we have displayed on the 2516, but this one has a boogie suspension or a boogie axle. This is what makes the tipper a quarry king. Because with this system, you are never worried about the terrain. It's a songa. Now, kusonga kwake, it's because one, it features a Tata B5.9 180 Barra Stage 3 or Euro 3 engine that churns out a respectable 180 horsepower while giving you about 14 to 15 tons of cargo that you would put inside this car. It gives you a, respect, a respectable torque of 690 Newton meters at somewhere between 15 to 1700 and the horsepower by the way can be achieved at between 2000 and 2400 rpm it also features you know something beautiful over here uh, it's one of those steepers that come in with a battery protective cases these two 12 volts uh, 12 volt batteries which are covered in here um, as tata you've already known about us we don't joke when it comes to tires we give you the real thing, and that is the spare tire over there. Now, if you walk with me, you always ask about this thing. This is the Hyper hydraulic system that is used to operate the tail lift, taking it up and taking it down. Very important feature. Of course, there's something that we don't show you guys, but today we will show you. You see this yellow button over here? This one is the cutout. So when I turn it to one side, it will disconnect power and therefore, you are not able to start the tipper. We have two air tanks because it features a dual Escom air brake that helps you in the braking system. And so after that, you know, just gonna walk to the front. So come with me. And show you, it's a signature Tata face. I mean, don't expect miracles. You've seen this face. I'm sorry, you will see it again and again and again because this is the signature tata face for our tippers of course the headlamp no headlamps your indicators are right here um, you can choose to do you know extra madoidos over here on the bumper if you want to you can add a mataza kusomahewa or fh up and make it you know stimakumi initiative if you want to but one of those things that makes this tipper unique is the internals and why we say that is when you come here, you are greeted by this nine-speed HD. 
So, for the next part of Trucks and Tech, as we talk about the Tata LPK 2518, we're going to get inside and show you what it is like inside this sticker. Stick around, I'll be right back after this short break. Welcome back to Trucks and Tech. Now we are inside the interior of the Tata LPK 2518 boogie suspension tipper. It's a two-seater. Yeah, two people only. The driver and his assistant. That will sit. My driver seat. So this is where we become practical. This is where you throw your comfort out of the window and you become practical because this seat is what you see is what you get. Now. You have seen the steering of the 2516 Tipper. Here we have a more smaller, more modern steering. Even the controls here are actually much more modern as opposed to what you see. Like I've said, we sit on a Cummins B5.9 uh, 180 uh, Euro 3 engine that's under here turning out 180 horsepower. But you saw that 9 speed thingy. So this is why it's called a 9 speed Tipper. If you look closely, you're going to see um, rivers low one three five seven two four six eight so it's a very simple mechanism of how to operate the steeper uh, it has a high it has both a high and low range of gears and so this by the way is the Tata G1150 nine speed gearbox so assuming you're in a quarry and this is why this guy is called the quarry king and you need to leave the quarry and you're loaded with about you know 15 tons of um, stones how do you ensure that you leave the quarry without damaging your accelerator or your gear there is a crawler gear and that is why this l stands for i mean it's not about taking an l like united fans did the other day it's about the lot it helps you leave challenging situations the reverse of course is to the light now when you shift and you get to gear 4 this is the low range anything that you see here is on the low range of gears now to shift to the high range of gears of course you clutch in so very simple clutch in you you slap the gear like that now I'm in the high range I'm able to operate 5 6 7 and 8 okay so assuming you're coming to a slowdown and you need to shift back to the high range of gears again it's not very difficult the same way i have gone to the high range is the same way i go back to the low range so this time i push it that way okay so this is what you call the splitter it helps you move between the high and low range so remember when you get to gear number four you have to slap the gear go to five six seven eight when you're gearing down, you also have to do the same thing and then you're able to access. Now, how does the internals look like? How does the controls and how does this engine sound? So, uh, as usual, we ensure that our gear is in neutral. I'm going to insert the key. So, if you could just, uh, before, I could, before I start the vehicle, um, let me show you the instrument cluster of this vehicle, of the 2518 uh, boogie suspension. Um, the first one, this is the light for the engine down here. So when you open this part uh, and this is on, you're able to operate the engine. You have to access the engine through opening this part. There are quite a number of stoppers to be removed so that you can do so. We're not going to do that today. The second button is for the air brake. Okay. Remember I mentioned dual SCAM air brake system. This is what it is for. Then we have the hazard. We have something to adjust the front beam. We have the light for the cabin just behind here. We have the headlamps, okay? And then this is for the diff lock. And you're lucky that in this vehicle we have two. Uh, this is one, and then there's another one that is manually operated on my side. And the instrument cluster of this vehicle is one of those things that marvel. You know, there's modernity in it. As opposed to the 2516 that is very basic, this one has what you call an ego pack, ego pack, instrument cluster and this is how it behaves so on your account vehicle is neutral so i'm just going to turn the key and just show you all things will so go in and then every other beam will adjust and the beep will go quiet and 
no need for pressing the accelerator when you start the vehicle. I mean, the idling stop is there and, and stuff like everything is just right there. And when you're on neutral gear, it will always show you that you're on neutral gear. Now, we're coming to the last part of this video, but so far, what are you learning about the MPK 25? 18 Tiba. Would really appreciate the comments that you give us. Oh, we didn't show them Kenya Power. This Kenya Power over here. Yes, it's a very tiny one. I know you guys are used to the 1216 one that is more brighter, but yeah. So estimate your corner. And of course, because you've seen there is no AC, don't worry. You won't die of heat inside here. We have a small AC over here, as Dan usually calls it. Our small AC. This is where it is. And that is the interior. What else do you want to see? Oh, safety belts. It's gonna be one here and one there for the co driver. Um, this is just similar to the 2518, only difference is has a better has a better gearbox, has a different style of the interiors uh, with a 140 kph maximum speed. Though here in Kenya, you know PGL have done that thing, so we're doing it. Two air gauges, a temperature and fuel makes it very easy to operate the sticker. So, stick on Taxon Tech, we're coming to the last part where we tell you to buy the sticker. We tell you about the price and we tell you why you should buy it. I'll catch you in the next one. And this is the final part of our Tata LPK2518 shoot series. And on our final part, we are just going to show you a few things that are here. And we hope that you will learn something from them. So, these three are a driver's best friend. Remember I showed you there's a button for this lock. Now what happens if that button decides not to function? Don't worry. There's another one here. Only that you need to open up here to be able to access it. This is the handbrake. <laughs> there's a reason why it's placed here. Because here it is not very easily accessible to anyone who is, you know, not the driver. Okay? If you happen to push it forward and the airport is on the trust me we're gonna have chaos on the road. So be very careful of the placement. Ensure that it is facing back. And lastly, yeah, this is the Hyper Tail Lift System Activation Button. When I lift it up and push it back, this guy will go up. Okay? When I lift this thing up, push this button behind, it's actually there. Push it up and push it behind. This guy when it goes up. We need a system of cameras for us to be able to display how it works live. And since he's shooting with only one camera, I hope that you guys will understand. But this one has to be pushed up and behind for it to go down. And to bring it down, this red button has to come down and then forward. And the thing is the down with the cable. So The air circulation system. Now you see the difference because we've shown you what the 2516. The 2516. I beg your pardon. Looks. Like, but this is now the different. It's more modern. My favorite part of this vehicle happens to be in here. We have a tank that can do about 350 liters of diesel. I tend to wonder how far that 350 liters take you. With a fuel consumption of about 3 kilometers per litre, do the math. Why is this guy the quality? This is a tipper that needs power and performance. The two P's that define the 2518. It brings power and it brings performance. Power in the sense that on this tailgate, I'm able to carry up to 17 tons. That's it. I'm in a circle. But legally, I'm just about to do in terms of this part. Performance with the engine and that coupled with the Tata G1150 gearbox, you get a Tifa that is able to do speed, it's able to do performance, it's able to go to qualities and come out without any hiccups. This Tifa currently will cost you 8.65 million Kenya shillings. And guess what? It's here, available in the Lorette at Films Limited. Who, by the way, a special thanks to them for providing us with this ticket. 
for us to shoot the video. Should you be interested in this and any other of our tippers, you know the dial 0720-586-035. That is 0720-586-035. And we shall be glad, myself and this guy shooting this video, be glad to help you acquire whether you're coming with cash or you need asset financing. We are here and ready to help you get to the next level. Bingwa Bora, that is our new slogan for this year. We are giving you vehicles that are able to perform, that are able to carry maximum load, and still be maintained at a cheaper cost and ensuring that you get maximum returns for your business. So, why don't you dare and take the bingo Bora step with the Tata LPK 2518 Bookie Suspension Tipper. My name is Double A and that's Wakanda forever.